Kenzie, can't believe this day is finally here. We've been dreaming about this for a long time, our dream day with our amazing friends and family. I couldn't ask for anything more than to share this day with you, a woman whose eyes can light up a room, whose laugh is so contagious, the glue that holds everything together, and who I can't think about without smiling. I knew that I'd found the one I wanted to spend my life with. I had dreams of this day, starting our family, watching each other grow and succeed, and growing all together. We've made and will continue to make mistakes, but forgiveness, patience, and grace have allowed us to grow through those times. They say anything good is worth fighting for, and what we have is the best. Uh, Sam's the best guy, best friend a guy could ask for. Uh, but there's only one person that can put up with him the rest of his life, and that's uh, Mackenzie. God may not have gave me a biological sister, but he gave me her, and I will forever be thankful. One, two, three! <laughs> Love y'all. <laughs> <laughs> I love you. It's beautiful. <laughs> Sam, the day is finally here. For such a long time, October 2nd seemed like a lifetime away, but the day has finally arrived. We are getting married. Nearly eight years ago, I didn't realize what an incredible journey we were on but I knew that it was gonna be something special. When Mackenzie and Sam got together our sophomore year of high school, I knew that she had found her person. These two were meant for each other. And I wanna thank the both of you for being two of my best friends. You are the best part of me. You make me a better person just by being you. Your smile instantly makes my bad days better. Your work ethic and drive to be the best truly inspires me. I cannot wait to be by your side to see everything you accomplish in life. There are days where it feels like you've been a part of my life forever, and days I'm just getting to know you. When I think back about everything we've been through, the times that no matter what happens in the day, when I see your face, I feel a sense of calm and relief. Your smile is electrifying, your eyes and smile light up a room, and it truly changes my day. Those moments outweigh anything. Not many people can say that they found the love of their life at 15 years old, but I'm lucky enough to say that I did. <laughs> I thank God every day that He put you in my life right when I needed you. I cannot imagine my life without you in it. Even at 15, I knew that I wanted to spend every day with you. Mackenzie, I promise to never stop loving you, to always make you feel special. I have never been more blessed than to marry the woman of my dreams, share this day with you, and share life with me. good I'm going to be at this whole life thing, but I promise that I will love you every single day, even during UT football when you're yelling at the TV. <laughs> I don't know where life is going to take us, but I do know that whatever life throws at us, as long as I have you by my side, it will all be okay. Thank you for being the woman that you are, patient, forgiving, caring, hardworking, endlessly gorgeous woman of my dreams. You're my best friend, and I want your love. I love you with my whole heart, Sam Officer, and I'm so proud to become your wife today. Love soon to be a Kinsey <laughs> Officer. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you gotta pay Sam. <laughs> I love you. Uh, I'm Austin, and uh, Sam and I have been uh, friends for a few years now. And uh, we quickly grew brothers. I've known Mackenzie for 17 years, and we instantly became best friends when we were seated at the same table in first grade. Just like most little girls, we talked about getting married and made a pinky promise when we were little that we were going to be each other's maid of honors. Sam and I have been through a lot him standing next to me on my wedding day 
and me listening to him for months on end, practicing for auctioneer school. I'm really glad everybody laughed. Uh, I guess uh, practicing does pay off because he's the best one I've ever met. So most people joke about not only dating their significant other, but also their best friend. And Sam knows this for a fact. I'm third wheeled. Austin's third wheeled. Like <laughs> they basically had a third wheel since they started dating at 15. Um, but thanks. I'm so glad to call you my best friend. My favorite memory of us has to be the time we went to the Hannah Montana concert and we ended up in People's Magazine. So first things first, Mackenzie, you look absolutely beautiful and stunning tonight. Okay, now that we've talked about the best part of Sam, I'm extremely honored to be here beside these two tonight on the greatest day of their life. Growing up, we always heard how hard it was to have the same best friend throughout the different stages of life, but thankfully we have got to experience them all together. From graduating kindergarten, middle school, high school, college with both of our degrees, and moving from four different houses in that time. Um, I'm so thankful to get to stand by you on your special day. I want to thank you, Sam, for having made my best friend so happy over the years. I've been so I'm so happy she gets to call you her husband. Congratulations to my best friends, Mr. and Mrs. Officer. I'm wishing you a lot of happiness. I'll end on this. They say good things happen to good people, and this is one of those things, and these are two of those people.